Hello everyone. Welcome to session one. Watery Wealth Embodiment. <laughs> How do you like that title? Isn't it lovely? I forgot to put some lip gloss on, so hang with me. I'm so professional. I'll let some people hop on, you know. Some people hop on, say hello when you arrive. We're gonna dive right into it. Hello, Mark. I see you, darling. Okay. I'm not real sure what's going on with the lighting here, but you know, it is what it is. You should see my setup. If you could only see my setup, you would laugh. I hope nothing falls over. I should probably go ahead and purchase, reinvest in a ring light that's not broken because I've got shit stacked up. I've got the light sitting back here. <laughs> Hot Mess Express. Uh, Facebook is effing with me. I'm going to fully embrace it. And I'm using my phone instead of my computer. Right? We, um, what's the word? We're adaptable. We're adaptable. We go with the flow. Okay, so do you have your mirror and do you have your water? If you do not have those two things, it's okay. But if you want to get the most out of this session, go grab a glass of water and a mirror. It can be just a little handheld mirror. My mirror is just a little handheld mirror sitting right below here. So you'll see me looking down, but you're going to be looking at yourself. So it doesn't matter where I'm looking, right? Okay. And what I want to do, maybe turn the lighting down just a little bit. Hold on. Hopefully it doesn't fall. Holding our breath. There we go. It's a little bit better. Okay. All right. Get comfy, everyone. Oh, so what we're going to do, I'm not exactly sure where we're going to go, but... We're going to first do a little bit of a quantum healing meditation. And then we're going to do some tapping and lock it in with a little bit more quantum healing. And so I want you to get comfy, get quiet, get your water. And let's start by holding our water against our heart space. We're going to come very present into the now moment. Fully present in our bodies. Focusing on your heartbeat. Roll your shoulders a little bit. If you feel any crackles or pops, breathing light into those spaces. I know that I'm feeling some crackles and pops. You may hear them. And roll your neck a little bit. Gently attentive to any pain, not pushing too far. Maybe moving your neck side to side, bringing your ear to your shoulder, forward and back. Relax your shoulders. And now visualize your heart light wrapping around your water, your vessel of water. Breathe deep. And exhale. And breathe deep, nice and low into your belly. Relax your hips. Relax your face and jaw. Relax into a smile. Feel your heartbeat. 
against the glass of water. And see your heart beating, sending love into that cup of water every heartbeat. Sending love into the water. Deep breath. Mm. Now let's just be silent and still for a moment as we invite in the light of Mother, Father, God flowing down in waves of golden light from the heavens. As thoughts come in, place them in the clouds and watch the clouds pass you by. Remind your brain that you are safe. It's okay to be quiet. Now imagine the spirit of water as a living being inside of your vessel of water. And what do you see the spirit of water as? Maybe it's a fairy or a dolphin or a color. See it dancing in your water. Dancing in your heart light. And the spirit of water is so grateful and for the love that we are sharing from our heart. for the collective energy, the amplified energy that we are creating together right now. Breathe. 
exhaling love into your water. The spirit of water reminds us that every time we say yes to this, to simple stillness, gathering together, to intentional focus, the unseen, that we are opening doors for ourself and so many others in the collective who are not yet ready. And that as we drink this water, blesses and moves through to the depths of our DNA. We code it with light and give it back to the world better than it came to us. Thank you. She thanks us. So much gratitude. Feel it. You are that powerful. We are that powerful. You are that loved. We are that loved. You are that important. We are that important. Deep breath. Exhaling love into our vessel of water. Smile. Relax your shoulders, your hips. Open your chest. Oh, open your heart. I see this beautiful golden flower opening up in our heart space. It's like this peony with all those thick, big petals that hug you, wrapping around our vessel of water and loving it. Coating it with all of the beautiful frequencies from the plant kingdom. Feel your heartbeat. And now again, reflecting on how the spirit of water has presented itself to you Just witness, focus, attention, love, gratitude into the waters within us and around us.
has such a powerful frequency of wealth is shown to us. And seeing the frequency of water dancing around us, lighting up the invisible tiny particles of water floating in the air around us. Everywhere. Are so wealthy. Deep breath. And I see the spirit of water lighting up the streams. Blessing them with golden light that you have invited in. And see the spirit of water blessing the lakes, the rivers, the waterfalls, the oceans, the ponds. that beautiful golden love that you have invited in, that we have invited in. We are that powerful to create such a change on this planet. See it. See the spirit of water dancing, dancing across all the bodies of water all over the world and in the air. Spreading this golden love everywhere. Deep breath. Exhaling the love into your water. now again, see all of that golden love that we've woven through the planet. And on the next breath, I want you to breathe it in. All of it is coming back to you as a gift for what you have given through your focused attention and intention. Feel your heartbeat. Take a nice deep breath and breathe it all in, in, in. <sighs> Amplifying it, hold it. Amplifying it within the waters within us and exhaling all of that love into your cup of water. <sighs> Relax. Open your eyes when you're ready, still holding your cup against your heart space. Feel your breath. As thoughts come in, just put them in the clouds, let them go, love them and release them. Relax your shoulders. And now, I want you to think of an intention. I want you to think of what you desire in your life. What do you choose for your life? 
maybe you want peace in your life. Maybe you want love, more love in your life. More fun, maybe more joy, more wealth. What do you want in your life? And I want you to speak into the water I choose and fill in the blank. I'm going to say I choose ease and flow. What do you want in your life? And speak it into the water as a choice. We're going to speak this intention into our water. Ready? Deep breath. I choose ease and flow. And what else? Maybe there's more. I choose peace. Relax your shoulders. I choose love. Smile. And now see the spirit of water, however he or she came to you, blessing this water, amplifying the intention. And my spirit of water is this little blue fairy with a little wand. And she's just swirling around with her wand, creating a little spiral and the water is turning into a vortex of golden light. See what you see, hear what you hear, feel what you feel. Relax your shoulders, relax your hips, open your chest, smile. Open your eyes when you're ready. And now we're gonna drink the magic. We're going to drink the intention, the love that we wove from our heart into the world and the earth gifting us back, her beautiful energy, the love of Mother, Father, God I mean, this is the ultimate vessel of water, okay? What? <laughs> so magical. And it's all amplified because we're doing this together. Take a drink. Hmm. Mm. And feel it. Feel it as it moves over your tongue and cleans your teeth and brushes against your gums and goes down the back of your throat, into your stomach. What a blessing, what a blessing it is for us to have water readily accessible to us. We are so blessed. And when we Remember to cherish these simple things that aren't simple to everyone. We call in more blessings. We invite in, allow in more blessings. Take another sip. Mm. I feel really good after that. Thank you, that was really delicious. Okay, now. Now that we've come into the present moment, let's rub our hands together, create some friction here. Oh, place your hands on your heart space. Let's code our hands with some more tender, loving care. As now we're going to do some tapping and lock in this invitation of what we are choosing in our life what we are choosing first within ourselves so that the external world 
can reflect it back to us because we know that that is the way it works. We cultivate what we desire inwardly first and the external world reflects it back to us in all these magical divine ways. Deep breath. And so calling back into your awareness this choice that we've made. I choose ease and flow. I choose love. I choose joy. I choose happiness. Maybe you just want more happiness. I want you to speak that choice into your heart space. I choose ease and flow. We're going to do that one more time. And I want you to see trailing from your vocal cords down into your heart space a color or sacred geometry that is the choice that's going to move into your heart space and pump that choice throughout every cell of your body. Ready? Take a deep breath and speak it out loud. I choose ease and flow. Let's do it again and really feel it. Feel that intention, invite it in, be fully present with the words. Deep breath. I choose ease and flow. And say it and feel it in the words you say. Notice when I say ease and flow, I'm saying it in a way that really encompasses and sounds like ease and flow, right? Or I choose joy. Okay, deep breath. I choose joy. <laughs> like I can't even say it without laughing. I choose joy. The words are encoded, aren't they? I choose joy. Oh, I feel like a little kid when I say it. I choose laughter. What about laughter? Imagine how much better life is when you have more laughter all of that oxytocin, I choose laughter. Like, can you say it without laughing? I can't. Okay, deep breath again. Now, with the awareness that, oh, we have flooded our body with that choice. Like we're hitting from all angles, aren't we? And now we have encoded light language. Our hands with that beautiful choice, that intention as it floods through our body because our heart is now pumping it throughout our body. And now we're gonna tap. This is what we're gonna do that's different than before. I got this nudge to involve the mirror. So, right, you're not gonna mess it up. If you don't have a mirror, it's okay. Do it again later and do it with the mirror. Um, and what I could look at like the camera, but I'm not going to, there's something, I'm gonna be looking down at my mirror because there's something about this energy of the mirror, right? Like it is a portal. And so what we're going to do is we need to look in your mirror and we're going to make that choice and we're gonna tap on it. And so I will talk you through the tapping points. You may have to look up every once in a while, but I really want you to maintain eye contact as much as you can and I want you to lean into the discomfort. Is it uncomfortable for you to look in the mirror and say these words to yourself? Are there feelings of unworthiness that come up? What thoughts, feelings, and emotions or people, situations come up into your awareness as you're tapping this choice into your body, into your nervous system, into the quantum field to support you? into the electro electrons so they can rearrange and really create the life that you desire. Life by design, right? We are designing our life with every tap, every intention. So, are you ready? Are you ready? <laughs> okay, so what is your intention again? I choose ease and flow. That's what I'm gonna say, I choose ease and flow. We're gonna start our tapping. Hold on, where are we starting? Deep breath. Mm, we're gonna start here. We're gonna start here at the inside of the eye, okay? Um, you can do one hand or two hands. I would say do one hand so that you can actually see yourself in the mirror. Are you ready? Okay, deep breath. We're gonna take a deep breath at every tap, 
tapping spot and try to look in the mirror as much as possible. Now I'm gonna cheat. I'm gonna be looking up every once in a while because I wanna make sure I don't lose connection or anything, but really stay with yourself, okay? Okay, ready? As thoughts come in, just witness them. Speak them out if you need to, allow them to move, but all it takes is just a witnessing. If you're just now joining us, hop in, you're not gonna mess it up, okay? We're doing some mirror work, ready? I'm making myself smile. <laughs> Monica, you're the shit, okay? You could say that to yourself too. Um, I choose ease and flow. Oh, does it feel funny? This feels funny to me. Lean into the discomfort. Keep looking at yourself. Ooh, wow. I'm feeling um, the tap is actually ampl amplified as I'm looking at myself and I'm tapping softer than I do when I'm looking at myself in the camera or not looking, it feels very amplified. Oh my gosh, you guys, we're so gonna move some shit here. Deep breath. I choose ease and flow. Now say this, I am worthy of fill in the blank. I am worthy of ease and flow. And as you look at yourself, focus on your best attributes. Look into your eyes. All of us have beautiful eyes, okay? There's not a person that doesn't have magnificent, beautiful eyes. The eyes are the window to the soul. We're tapping this into the soul. Oh my gosh, this is just genius, isn't it, you guys? Okay, it's all my higher self, okay? And collectively, you all manifested this too, right? I am you, you are me, you manifest it. Okay, I hope. It just said I was trying to reconnect. I hope I'm really here. Okay. I choose ease and flow. Okay, now we're going to go to the outside of the eye. Outside of the eye. I choose ease and flow. Mm. And now say that choice as your truth. My truth is ease and flow. And I'll say your name and say, I'm magnificent. Monica, you are magnificent. Monica, you are ease and flow. Monica, I love you. Tell yourself that you, that you love you. And some tears, like really, I feel tears coming up for you all. Let them flow, deep breath. <sighs> Monica, I love you. I choose ease and flow. Now go under the eye, under the eye, deep breath. Oh, what's coming up for you? What's, what would get in the way of ease and flow? Do you see a person coming up in your life? Or maybe you're choosing happiness and you see someone coming up in your mind's eye that blocks your happiness. Call them back into love and say their name maybe. And so and so, I'm loving you into ease and flow. Tell yourself you love you. Monica, I love you. Deep breath. <sighs> now under the nose, right under the nose, smile. And we get to love every single part of ourselves. Do you notice that sometimes when you look in the mirror, you look at the flaws and the imperfections? You get what you look for, right? And so we get to train ourselves to look for our most beautiful loved attributes. And in that awareness, we get to love all of the supposed faults, the things that we uh, resist, the things that we deny, the things that we um, need to turn the lights on to, right? We get to hold every aspect of ourselves with love. And now as you're looking at yourself, I want you to look at a flaw. There are no flaws, right? It's all an inversion. It's a lie. If it's a flaw and it doesn't feel good, it's not really a flaw. There's no such thing. Go to what you feel is a flaw. And love it. Send love to it. I love you. 
I love you, pimple. <laughs> I love you, pimple. Send love to it. Send light to it. Smile. Chin. Or maybe you like don't like your nose or something or your ears. Send love to us. I love you. I love you, little button nose. I love you. I love you, little red vein. Deep breath and breathe love into that space. Oh my gosh, we only get one body in this lifetime. Why would we not love it all? Why would we not love it all? And now you get to say, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Monica, for all of the ways in which I have denied ease and flow. I choose it now. I choose ease and flow. Smile. I love you, Monica. Deep breath. Open your heart space. Go down to your collarbone. I choose ease and flow. Deep breath. If feelings of unworthiness are coming up, witness them. But I say it. Oh, but I made this mistake or I made that mistake. But I hurt this person or I hurt that person. Say it out loud. But I. Deep breath. And now tell yourself, it's okay. I was doing the best that I could. Even if it wasn't my best. Even if I acted out of hurt or anger. Even if it wasn't the best version of me. I still love you, Monica. Uh, I choose ease and flow. Okay, now, remember, <laughs> people get a laugh out of this. Find your nipple, go down to the bottom of your rib, and tap there. <laughs> Maybe your nipple's down there. Some of us ladies get that joke. It is what it is. It's okay. We get to love our boobs no matter what. Right? It's all good. <laughs> I just spit. <laughs> I choose ease and flow. I choose to love all parts of me. I am perfect. I am, per I am perfect. Is it hard to keep looking at yourself? I'm having a hard time. Deep breath. <sighs> okay, now reach under your armpits right here. Tap in both sides. I choose ease and flow. I'm worthy of ease and flow. I'm so worthy. Try to relax your shoulders as you do it. Deep breath. Hang with me, y'all. One more round. We're almost there. You may be burping and stuff. That's okay. It's all clearing. Maybe you're yawning. Maybe you're crying. It's okay. It's all perfect. Right, Monica? Deep breath. <sighs> okay, now, top of the head. Tap all around the head. All around the head. Mm. Maybe you're feeling some tightness in your neck come up. I choose ease and flow. I choose ease and flow. I choose ease and flow. Deep breath. <sighs> okay, now back to the eyebrow here. Um, I am, I am ease and flow. I am joy. I am peace. Whatever feels good, whatever your intention is, I am joy. I am love. I am love. I am love. Deep breath. I am love. I am love. I am love. How does it feel when you say the word that you choose to be? Okay, now. Outer eye, I am love, I am love. I am worthy of love, I choose love, I am love. I love you, deep breath. <sighs> Under the eye, 
I'm gonna do both, both eyes here. Deep breath. I am love. I choose love. I'm worthy of love. Under the nose. Deep breath. <sighs> Look deep into your eyes, deep into your eyes in your mirror. Look straight into your eyes, nowhere else, and say it. I choose fill in the blank. I choose love. I choose love in every aspect of my life. I am love. Chin. Deep into your eyes. Keep looking in your eyes. I love you, Monica. Say it to yourself. I love you, Monica. I love you, Monica. Deep breath. Do you see all of those aspects of yourself coming up to be loved? As you look in your eyes, the hurt, wounded part of you that wants to be illuminated and witnessed Deep breath. All of the parts that you hide. And now look at yourself and say, I don't want to hide anymore. I choose to be seen. I choose to be seen. I am safe to be seen. I choose to be loved. Deep breath. <sighs> Collarbone. Look in your eyes. And now see the spirit of water in your eyes. See your eyes as a beautiful body of water. See the water within you. See the wealth within the water of your beautiful eyes. see the ocean in your eyes. Deep breath. We are the ocean. Say it. I am the ocean. I am the wave. I am the drop. I am the ocean within the drop. The ocean within the drop. Deep breath. I am the fractal. And the universe. All at the same time. Bottom of the ribs. Are you still looking at yourself? Don't cheat. I am powerful. Deep breath. Breathe into your solar plexus. I am powerful. I am powerful beyond measure. What comes up for you? Awareness around anyone who has made you feel powerless. A situation that has you feeling powerless. Let it come up. Deep breath. I am powerful beyond measure. I choose to be powerful beyond measure. And now under the armpit, reach across. Deep breath. 
And now see the spirit of water dancing within your eyes and around you, alchemizing any doubt, alchemizing any limiting beliefs coming up around you being powerful, you choosing power, I choose power. Wherever you feel that in your body, the spirit of water is moving to alchemize that limiting belief. Deep breath. Let's go back to the head. Deep breath. Mm, tapping all over, tapping the back of your neck. And now as you're tapping your head, so your whole body, see your whole body shaking. Okay, you know what? I want to go to the, I want you to pound your chest like a gorilla. Mm. Deep breath, moan. Mm. Ooh, and say out loud, I am releasing across the entire multiverse. Anything real or imagined. that would block me from choosing, fill in the blank, ease and flow. For me, it's ease and flow. And now see, as you beat on your chest, I want you to see the spirit of water moving within you. And what's happening is any sort of doubt or, mis or um, disbelief or limiting beliefs or ancestral trauma or bondage you're literally vibrating it out of your body and it's leaving through your pores, leaving like a cloud of dust going back into the universe as the gift, the truth of love that it actually is. Now look in the mirror. <sighs> Relax your tap. Hands on the heart. Ooh, feel the vibration. Look in the mirror and just be still for a moment, looking deep into your own eyes. And see the divinity within you, every cell of your body. And say, I choose magnificence. I choose wealth in all the ways. I am a tidal wave of abundance. Deep breath. I am a tidal wave of love. I am a tidal wave of joy for myself and the multiverse. Smile, close your eyes. We're locking that into every cell of our body. Feel your heartbeat. We are so worthy of love beyond our wildest dreams. Raining down upon us is love beyond our wildest dreams. Mission beyond our wildest dreams meaningful, aligned, joyful impact beyond our wildest dreams. Deep breath, breathe it in. It is all here for us. And we choose 
our highest divine timeline. Now, right now. Relax your shoulders. Smile. Feel your heartbeat. Now if you have water left, drink it in. Okay. That was magnificent. You are magnificent. We are magnificent. Okay, I have homework for you. You didn't think you thought you were gonna get away with that homework? Mm mm. It's actually a home play. Okay. Got my computer right here next to me, and what I'm gonna do here is I have a YouTube video that I want to share with you. I'm going to mute myself. I'm gonna get on my computer right now and drop this home play in the comments. Hang with me. And what this is, one of my absolute favorite gems on YouTube, her name is The Green Tara Guru. She is divine. Um, I just put it in there. I'm getting fancy over here, okay? Um, I hope that actually goes as a link. Yeah, it's it says it's posting. Okay, boom. What you're gonna see, it's, it's the OM, okay? So the sound OM is the sound of the universe. OM. Do you understand that if you would just, and I'm not speaking at you, I'm speaking to me too, Monica, okay? I'm speaking to myself right now and I'm just sharing it with you, a reminder to all of us and self. If we will take like literally two minutes, five minutes would be even better, and sit down and chant the Om. That's it. Chant the Om. People say it's hard for them to meditate. What if you chanted the Om? The sound of the universe. Your problems will dissolve. And so what happens with chanting the Om is that we release control of the specificity of what we need fixed in our life. And we actually connect with the quantum field where all of the solutions are. We connect with the bigger part of ourselves that holds all of the answers. And so without even stating what you need, you're calling in the divine support. Um, you are sending the, the sound of the universe. You're vibrating it through every cell of your body, the waters within. And so then the waters within to the depths of our DNA can tune in to the frequency of the universe, of our soul, of spirit. And in doing that, we're like an antenna. We become like an antenna to receive everything that we desire in order to amplify our physical, physical experience, in order to live our life by design, right? We're all designing our own lives, but are we designing it with intention and focus? Or are we flopping around like a fish out of water? Right? Okay, so um, the YouTube is here in the comments. It's It says Om Om Yogananda, most powerful Om ever. You will love this. Put it on. Now, I'll give you a hot tip. You know, I always got a hot tip for you. If you click on the link and don't go into the YouTube app, just click on the link and let it pop open for you without, go, do not hit go into app, you will not get commercials. This is what I do, like whenever I get on YouTube, I always, I will grab a link to whatever I wanna listen to, I will go, um, I will copy and paste it into Messenger, and then I'll click on it in Messenger, and I'll go, that's where I'll access it, and you don't get commercials, right? Hot tip, okay. <sighs> All right, tell me how you feel in the comments. CJ, freaking powerful. I felt the dam burst open in love and abundance and prosperity come rushing in my entire body. Ah, I love it. Ah, started to sweat. Yes, awesome. Okay, I love y'all so much. 
thank you, thank you um, for coming. Thank you for engaging. Please, you are welcome to invite your friends into the group. Yes, I do share my mission and my business here, but I'm not going to spam you. I'm not going to spam your friends. My goal is meaningful value first, okay? But if I didn't share my business, then people wouldn't know I didn't have it. They wouldn't know I had a business, and then nobody would have the opportunity. So just know this group is open to all. Uh, my business is the reason that I can share these free offerings to you. So have the best evening or day wherever you are in the world. Tag your friends. Um, send the link to your friends so that they can come into the group. All are welcome here, okay? All right. I love you all so much. We'll be back tomorrow again at 8.30 p.m. And um, yes, please keep posting in the comments um, how you felt and how that landed for you, okay? Come back with your mirror and your water tomorrow, 8.30. We'll do it again on Sunday. So shoot, by the end of Sunday, oh my gosh, we're all gonna be just a puddle, okay? <laughs> all right, I love y'all so much. Have the best night, bye-bye.